Welcome Survivalists and Seven Days to Die fans. Um, I'm bringing you another seed showcase. This time it's a it's an oldie, uh, but a goodie. This one's been around a while. I couldn't tell you where this one originated from, so apologies if uh, to the originator for not mentioning them. But this one has been around a while. It's been mentioned quite a lot in the Seven Days to Die forums. Uh, this is all our destiny. It's all one word. I'll bring that up on screen for you now. So it's a capital A in all, capital O in our, capital D in destiny, no spaces in between. Okay, let's have a look. This is another three hub city map. So let's have a look at what we got here. So, main hub city. I'm just as close to central as I can. There is a little bit of uh, wasteland biome here, but it's a tiny little slither. Uh, zero, zero is pretty much this point here so it's a little north of uh, zero zero but you hone in on zero zero you will find this um, three hub cities ten towns six traders and two crossroads uh, that's what I've found on here uh, if you look at the forums there are uh, various mentions of this particular seed but I couldn't find anything that, that showed it as a seed showcase that sort of you know, shows the maps um, and when I'm playing and looking for a seed I'm really looking for an idea of uh, what's around. There are a lot of random gen seeds that can be uh, pretty poor. Okay, so let's get into this one. Three hub cities, where are they? I've got to remember myself. So, central hub city here. I think if we go down southwest, we'll come to these other towns in a minute. Uh, we have another decent sized hub city. Again, not full blown hub city, but uh, not far off. It's just missing one row. Uh, for it to be a full-blown uh, hub city, or two rows actually, it's by four instead of by six. Uh, but it's still a decent sized hub city, that's down to the southwest. If we come back to the central hub city again, this time we go northeast, we shall find another medium sized hub city up in the northeast corner. So these ones sort of run in a triangle, uh, straight line, sorry, in a diagonal um, across the map from northeast down to southwest but there's some good cities and uh, towns sorry in between so there's your three hub cities All right we've got ten towns to try and uh, show you off and six traders the traders are spread out a bit and there are some other notable areas to mention on this map which we'll sort of get to but this one has been a popular seed for a long time and first came about when the game first came out and POIs didn't spawn so those are the buildings on the end of the gravel roads off the main streets so having a number of towns uh, was, was a sought after a random jed seed uh, just to make up for the lack of POIs now with the POIs that's just a great seed uh, if we head north we always tend to head north so head north from the main city uh, there's a road that takes you up to a nice green town up here but it is uh, crossed into with a uh, wasteland, but oh, how big is this wasteland? Looks like it comes down to here. It's not a huge wasteland here, but I mean it is wasteland nonetheless. Uh, but a decent sized town, uh, decently populated with the, the main stores that you're looking for. So that was straight north. I'll put the cursor over so you can just pause and uh, grab the coordinates for that. So just a quick check again. Alright, so that was north from the main hub city. So if we uh, traverse out to the east, we'll then come into the uh, northern, uh, northeast part or northeast hub city that we've uh, just seen. So not a lot up in the north and northeast. There is a decent town. There is roads that connect through it, and there's nothing more out this way. We're pretty much around the edge of the map out here, I think as well so uh, nice green biomes around the area and the size of the biomes are quite uh, are quite large but there is some uh, mixed up stuff in amongst this as well so that was north of the hub city so and to the east so if we have a look to the west we have a nice four way here some dead ends huge planes remember these planes just look like they went on forever when I was going through them uh, so we've got a nice four-way here. There is a bunker on this one. I don't know if that'll cut across or whether that's random, depending on you know whether that's uh, permanently in this particular location, this four-way. But that was quite a nice spot for a bunker, I thought. Uh, follow the road out further to the west, and that'll bring us to another town that's 
in a burnt biome, uh, plains and green. So it's not a bad location, but we are up towards the edge of the map here on the west side. Having a look in here, I don't know if there was any bunkers. I had a little look earlier, I don't think I could see any. Uh, but uh, enough of the other points of interest in order to make it a worthy sort of loot stop at least. And north from there, well that's got to be the edge. So it's just a huge big plains biome from there. So not a huge amount to the north. Follow this back out again to the west. Uh, that was the four way that went off to the other town. If we go more west from the hub city now, it'll bring us to the one of the closer towns to the uh, central hub city. This is in a burnt biome and a green biome. I think there was a couple of bunkers in this one when I was looking. I believe that's one of the bunkers there. And yeah, we've got the well bunker over here. This one's got quite a lot of space around it as well, so if you like the eerie burnt biome, and you put your sort of zombie killing base around there, that can be uh, quite uh, spooky to look at. There is a fair bit of water around here, but we'll cover that in a minute, where I'll show you why that's important. So if we carry out our west, we come across a, a decent sized town, uh, plains and a wasteland. That's wasteland I think goes on for quite some out this way, but then we are towards the edge of the map out here. So it's not really in the way. Um, because you're close to the edge as well, I think from a plane drop or an airdrop uh, perspective, I don't know whether stuff can drop into the radiated zone. Perhaps it does. Uh, but a decent sized town. The waste the mines aren't inside the town area, but they will be uh, along the outside of it. Uh, but you do have green, bit of snow, bit of desert close by as well so it's, it's not too bad um, a location but uh, another uh, decent sized town right coming back to the central hub this time we'll head out uh, east and see what we can find so we've got a, a big chunk of water here so to get around it you do need to go quite a ways up north this chunk of water also covers the south uh, for quite some time so to get around that you've you pretty much yeah, there's your road there in order to cut across. I was trying to map how if there was a an easier way to get from the hub city south. Uh, but you've got to circumvent around quite a bit to do that. But there is a decent town out here as well. This one's in green and swamp. Again, if I just hover over, you can get the coordinates for that. Uh, leading out into some other very large plains uh, biome there. And again, if you follow the road up, that takes you to the central, or not the central, the uh, hub city that's northeast. So that was to the east again, so what we say, water, nice big green biome, big plains biome, there is desert out here as well. If we follow that down south in this desert there's a four-way, I think that's the second one, that's uh, the two we've now seen, and you carry on south down here into the southeast corner we have a town in a wasteland uh, biome uh, right on the edge of the border uh, the, of the radiated zone. I nearly drove into that. Ended up seeing it just in time. Just cut across just the map as much as you can. Uh, there was a bunker down here. Oops. I thought I think there's one there as well. Uh, this one here. I thought, oh, if I put a base here. This is before I saw the radiated zone. I could watch all the zombies come walking in over the wasteland, blowing themselves up on the mines, but so close to the radiated zone, I don't know if that's uh, where I want to be. Uh, we're getting cold here. Let's get rid of the shivering sound. Just put that on. And back to the map. Okay, so back into the central hub. So that was down to the south east, so down this way. Following that across, we have another town again in the wasteland biome. Uh, a little bit of green. Again, decent for uh, uh, looting, obviously. I believe this road here will connect to this connection here. So, following again, we're down on the south border now. Um, how far are we from the central area? We're going to cover this town in a minute, and there's another one over here. So, yeah, straight south. 
go to the place of towns. You've got a nice town out in the uh, desert, uh, a little bit of green, uh, burnt biome there, so not a lot of wasteland around this one until you get out to this part over here. Uh, this is a big town in the desert. I know the map looks crap, but it's just nice sandy desert when you're in there. It's very difficult to make out what's in here. It's quite well populated, I thought. And again, it just has roads that lead off into uh, dead ends, but yeah, I guess it takes you deeper into some of the uh, other biomes. Uh, I haven't been mentioning the traders. So the traders are marked with X's on uh, on here. So we've got one down here as well. There's only what was it six of them, so they're rare. We follow that round that takes us back into the uh, southwest uh, hub city. So we've covered quite a lot of the towns now. Most of them are sort of run a ring around the outside edge. That's to the four ways. That's to the green and swamp, and then up here to the hub city. So we come back down to the central hub city and we look at the other closer towns. So the really close ones would be this one here. We have a trader just up here. The other close by one would be up uh, north, which would be here. I don't believe there was any traders up this part. Just have a quick look. No. We have a trader over here. Now, I don't know if that's actually on an island. Because I think this water goes around. I think these are islands. I tried to find a way across. It's relatively shallow between these little islands. So you could bridge your way across if you wanted a, uh, a shortcut, if you like. Uh, there is a connection here if you need be, or you could probably cut across up here anyway um, on dry land. Uh, so another trader nearby the hub city. That's not a bad location. Just trying to find out where all the other traders are that we've passed by. None out this way. But there's not a lot out this way. A couple of towns worth looting. Okay, this will connect up to here. So back to this town. Uh, so south of this lake that uh, pretty much covers the whole south and east of the hub city, uh, two more towns. Uh, nice plains town. A good selection of the uh, shops and uh, POIs that you'd be looking for. Why are there any bunkers in here? I can see one straight away down. Okay, we've got one over here, which will be the uh, little shed one with the panel fencing. And we have the well bunker um, down here. We have a prison in here as well. It's quite well populated, I thought, the town, considering there's uh, 10 of these towns. Um, oh yeah, hover over it for you. Sorry, coordinates. And if we uh, just go off a little to the uh, west side, we have another similar sized town in the desert. Again, um, most of the stores that one would be looking for. Is there any bunkers in here? I didn't see any missile, so, uh, missile silos on my journeying around. I don't know if there's a bunker in here. I tend to get bunkers in most of the towns. Uh, but there is a swathe of wasteland out here, so on its way to the other hub city. So it's close to the uh, two hub cities. There is more of a connection across. Yeah, then you have to then come round in order to get to uh, the other hub city, but you can stop off at another town. So uh, three hubs, ten towns, six traders, and two crossroads. Uh, the seed, all our destiny. Put it up on screen for you. Uh, worthy Seed's been around a while, uh, looks like it could be uh, quite good fun. Uh, certainly one I'm considering for a playthrough that I'm uh, looking at doing again, but again, the, the draw being uh, the three hub cities. Uh, maybe a little too much water for me, but uh, uh, we'll see. If you like building bridges, have fun with this one. Okay, thank you very much for watching, I hope you liked. Uh, if you'd like to see more of these, uh, please don't forget to subscribe and uh, hit that like button. Alright, until next time. Take care. Bye for now.